so much stuff, so much stuff, I have got so much stuff. Hey, hi, hello, my name's Alexis, and before we get started, I would just like to say yes, I did dye my hair. So, nobody freak out. So today I have a really big haul for you. Maybe on your standards it's not really big, but for my standards it's pretty big. I got a lot of stuff, so let's just get dive right in because I have like bags everywhere. So first I actually went to a thrift store and I found this really cute black dress. It's a really short one, no big deal, I love short dresses. And the back has this like stringy, I'm not even sure how to begin to describe this, but I thought it was really cute. Plus it was only like, I think five dollars? I mean, that's amazing. Next I went to Payless. And at Payless I got some super hot black heels. Oh my god, yes. Can't even say anything else about them, it's very self self-explanatory. Black heels, but just, oh, they're so gorgeous. Next, I went to a store in the mall that's relatively new, and it's called J. Thompson. They got some cute stuff, so. First, I got this dress. It's collared. It's kind of sheer right here up in the shoulders in the upper chest area, and then it's got these ruffles here, and then it's just a really nice chiffon material. It's super cute. I absolutely love it. It is just adorable. The next thing I got there is this skirt. It's a cream colored um, tulle with a elastic waistband so you can wear it around your hips, you can wear it higher up on your waist, wherever you want to put it. I just thought it was so cute. The last thing I got is the thing I am most excited for at the store and that is a leather jacket. This leather jacket was actually on sale so fantastic but it's just got some really nice zipper detail and then this bottom part down here can actually zip all the way around so you can take it off which is what I think I might do but it's just it's so it's so nice it's so quality it looks really good on me not to toot my own horn but it does so so excited for this next I went to Wet Seal Wet Seal always has a for their sale items they always have buy one get one for a penny so that's what I did the thing that I actually paid for was this red dress it has the cutoffs in like right where the waist is and then it has if I can get them straps and in the back they do like the crisscross thing but I just thought it was so cute and my friend had it in her hand first but then she put it down and I was like you know what let me try it on and I tried it on and I was like oh my god this is amazing like I look hot in it and I have baby face so it's hard for me to look hot in things like baby face problems but I look so nice in this and plus with those heels I win and then the thing I got for a penny was this um, tank top thing um, on the website it's described as a wave tank but I don't know I think it looks more like a sunset can you even see it because it's so so see-through like obviously I'd have to put something under this probably a white tank top but it is a tank top it has like a a U thing in the back Hello. and it has a tie at the bottom but it's really cute and I got it for a penny I'm just like chucking all the bags onto my bed and the last clothing store that I went to was Forever 21 so the first thing I got there, similar to the cream skirt that I got at J. Thompson, I got a mint green one. I'm, this isn't tulle though, I think this is more of like chiffon, but it has the same elastic waistband, you know, wear it at your waist, wear it at your hips, wear it wherever you want, so I got that. And then another thing that I got, I wasn't too sure about it because it has like a big well, not a big, but it looked like it would be like a big opening in this stomach. And I'm like self-conscious about my body. So I was like, let me try it on. Let me see how it looks. But it looked great. Like I could pull the shorts part up and the top part went really far down. So it covered. But this is what I'm talking about. This is a... I think it's marketed as a jumpsuit because it's two pieces. I would describe it more as maybe a romper, but it has the opening in the middle to show your stomach. But I thought it was so cute, my friend handed it to me and asked me if I wanted to try it on, and I'm glad I did because it is really cute and it does look really nice. 
So it's just little shorts and a top that has some buttons and a tie at the bottom. So I'm glad, I'm glad I tried it on. I even told uh, the lady that was checking me out, I was like, I'm glad he made me put this on. So there's that. All right, now that we're done with all of the clothes, we can move on to makeup. So first at Ulta, I got the Lorac Pro Palette, or Lorac Pro Palette, however you want to pronounce it. Um, I am on a beauty forum. I had said that I was thinking about maybe getting a naked palette, and a lot of the girls that were saying, no, get this instead, so I did a little bit of research on it, and I'm glad they suggested this for me because it is really nice. Oh my god, the colors are just beautiful. There's, if you haven't seen this before, there's, um, eight matte colors at the top and then eight shimmer colors at the bottom. I'm not too sure about the shimmer colors, but I'm looking at like, especially these three, which are Garnet, Deep Purple, and what is this? Slate. They're beautiful. Like, I would hella use these colors, even though I don't like shimmers that well. So, I'm really excited for this. And of course, it came with the behind the scenes eye primer, just a little like, um, what is the word I'm looking for? A sample size, so I will definitely use this to see how I like it. Ah, I'm so excited for it. The other thing I got at Ulta is brushes. Um, these brushes are from Real Techniques. These are the core collection brushes, so they're like face brushes. I have not used them yet because I didn't want to show you dirty brushes, but I did open the packaging and I touched them and they are so soft. They're so soft, like I cannot wait to put these on my face. They are that soft. They are just amazing. So, very excited to be using these too. And I love the case that they come with. Very handy. Very handy. Next for makeup is from MAC. The only thing I got at MAC was a travel size bottle of the Fix Plus. Um, I just wanted to try it out, so I thought I'd get a small bottle instead of the big bottle, because then what if I didn't like it? But I did use this yesterday when I went out, and I did see a bit of a difference of the staying power of my makeup. So I'll keep using it and see how well I like it. But so far, it's pretty good. I'm really excited for it. I'm kind of just excited for everything, aren't I? So the last thing are accessories and those I got from Claire's. The first thing I got, I am a child of the 90s and children of girls of the 90s will know that the hair bows were not these teeny tiny hair bow things. They were big, stick them on the side of your head or stick them on like your ponytail kind of hair bows. And I love those. I think they are so cute. I love big hair bows or at least good sized hair bows. So I got this black hair bow from Claire's and it's just a really nice I don't even know what material this is but it feels really nice it's really soft it's kind of like floofy and I am so excited another hair piece that I got is a flower crown these are I'm not even sure what kind of flowers these are but they're little orange flowers I thought they were really cute there's not really much I could say about it, I just, I really wanted a flower crown and I was trying some on at the store and this one was the only one that wasn't like completely taking over my head. Um, and the flowers are a really nice small size, so I thought it was really cute. The last thing I got is a necklace, this is what I got, it's a, you know, on heart monitors, it has the lines, that's what this is, it's in gold. Um, my best friend showed this to me and said, this is really good for you because I don't think you guys know, but I have a heart condition, so on EKG monitors and stuff like that, my lines do not do that. <laughs> they don't do what they're supposed to do, but I still thought it was really cool. Um, even though I don't like gold that much, I really liked this, so I'm pretty sure I'm going to end up wearing it with like everything. So that is what I got. So that is everything clothes makeup accessories oh <sighs> anyways that's all i have for you guys today i hope you enjoyed all the links to all of my social media will be down in the description hi i did that somewhat normal also don't forget to subscribe if you have not already and i will see you guys next week bye